Right, ladies and gentlemen, this will have to be a very crowded video. Um, I'm selling this book, which is scarce enough in itself, not as a book, but as a collection of Victorian photographs, because tipped into the book is a collection of Victorian original calotype photographs. About the book first, it is virtually dismembered. It's all complete, but it's in pretty appalling condition. Um, it is an 1855 book by William McGill of Ray, um, uh, The Natural History of Deeside and Braemar, the Balmoral area of Aberdeen. Um, the book was unfinished or, or, or just finished at McGill of Ray's death, and the manuscript was purchased by Queen Victoria and Prince Albert for private private circulation, hence the royal arms on the cover. Prince Albert gave many copies of this to uh, worthy institutions uh, and it was something of a royal project because it covered the Balmoral area. Um, it has its original folding map of the River Dee, I think partially hand-coloured. It has around 14, 13 or 14 um, woodcut illustrations in it. There's a further folding map of... Um, the uh, area at the back, the D uh, basin there. As I say, the book is virtually falling apart. However, that's not its main interest. Um, it's scarce enough anyway. Uh, the three copies of it I've, I've found uh, on the 140 million aid book antiquarian book site at the moment are priced at 199, 295 and 350 pounds. But forget that for the moment. This book has tipped into it where I've placed these um, uh, stickers I think 48 or 49 original calotype photographs, not trade ones, but calotype photographs, datable from costumes of people appearing in some of them to around the mid 1850s, the period of this book. And they're tipped into the book with pencil annotations at the front at the places at which these photographs were later taken. So the reviews of, 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 of I think, sort of Braemar or Ballot or wherever it might be, the reviews of Waterfalls, there are several views of Balmoral Castle, there are views of um, um, two, two, two pictures of, of, of people, a little boy and uh, the same, I think, little boy learning the bagpipes. There is a large calotype here. Um, I'm not sure where that's of. Again, specially tipped in on separate pieces of paper. Um, there is the little boy in his tam -shanta hat at the back. Um, and so it goes on. There's also a small engraving being tipped in of Aberdeen. There is an engraving of Marischal College, uh, where McGillivray was a professor, with people obvious in the costumes of the mid-1850s when you look at them in great detail. There's another one of a street scene, if I can find it, in Aberdeen. Uh, I'm not sure where that is just at the moment, but there's a loose picture here, um, which... Uh, is inserted there. So basically, I'm selling it as a collection of calotype pictures. Aberdeenshire, Edinburgh, Aberdeen were, was a place for pioneering work in the calotype um, photography of the period. Um, somebody called George Washington Wilson, I think, of Aberdeen, uh, pioneered these in the 1850s and was invited to Balmoral to take calotype pictures. There may be some connection with him. So do look at the uh, photographs in my listing, but as you'll see, this contains, as well as its engravings, 50, around 50, just under 50, calotype photographs of the scenes in the book. It's nothing to do with the publication of the book. The book contained no photographs originally. They've been tipped in later on. There are two views of the absolutely newly built, uh, newly restored Balmoral Castle in around 1856. Thanks very much. Bye.